I have a canoe, and sometimes I like to use it solo, but it's kind of a pain in the butt to move it around by myself. So, I built this cart, and I'm going to show you how I did it. I found other designs online for canoe kayak carts, but they didn't quite fit my needs. I came up with this design that allows you to carry a canoe or kayak right side up. But it also has these extra wings on the side, which will allow you to carry a kayak upside down. The cart is made from one inch diameter PVC. These top supports are 14 inches long. These upper supports are 12 inches across. The side wings are each nine inches. The upper section is seven inches from the bottom section. The handle is just the portion of PVC left over from the 10 foot section I bought. It's about 14 inches. The axle is a 5 8 inch threaded rod that goes through an end cap with a 5 8 inch hole drilled in it. There's a 5 8 inch flat washer to prevent the wheel from digging into the PVC. The wheels are 10 inch wheels. They're rated at 300 pounds each, which is way overkill for this project, but they were dirt cheap, $4 at Harbor Freight. The wheels then are held on the end by 5 8 inch nylon insert lock nuts. The, the axle was a two foot section that I had to cut off a couple inches off the end. The foam on the supports is just PVC pipe insulation. Some people use pool noodles, but this insulation was actually cheaper and it fits the pipe perfectly. I really like the way the cart turned out. It makes it a breeze to move the canoe around by myself. It also makes it super easy to load the canoe on top of the car. If you decide to build one of these, I'd love to see a photo or a video of it in action. I hope you found the video helpful. If you did, give it a thumbs up. You can also subscribe to keep up to date with my newest videos. Thanks for watching. Waiting for an airplane. Tadis, no. No, no. That is a loud truck. They are, oh, jeez.